I used to think that God was unfair and I couldn't understand why he allowed so much pain and suffering in the world without intervening. I was brought up to fear God. I thought God was punishing and unforgiving. However, when I was in my late thirties, I had a really powerful revelation that God is love. I remember feeling completely overwhelmed with love and full of the joy of God, wisdom, compassion, understanding. It felt supernatural. Three years ago, I went along to Woody's church on a Sunday service for the first time and I was both pleasantly surprised and moved to tears. At the time, I wasn't quite sure why the tears were there, um, just that I knew I was surrounded by tremendous love and felt very safe. And outside the church, the world felt like a very dangerous, dark place. I decided to follow Jesus because I'd seen the wonderful transformation in my daughter's life after she became a Christian. It took me quite some time, however, to open my heart fully to Jesus. I felt conflicted and, to be honest, I was worried about what my friends and other people might think of me if I said I was going to find Jesus. After taking a leap of faith, I did invite Jesus and the Holy Spirit into my heart and almost immediately I noticed changes begin to happen in my life. Jesus has made a phenomenal difference to me and my life. He's been like a bridge over troubled waters. He has literally been restoring and bringing unity to my once disconnected family. During the past 12 months since I was baptised, there have been so many miraculous events in my life which are a testament to God's help. Situations that I completely believed were impossible to change are now repaired and flourishing. In March of this year, I was put in touch with my mother after a long absence. I found out her whereabouts were in a care home and a week after that, care homes went into lockdown due to the pandemic. After a week, I found out that my mother, who was 80 years old, had been taken to hospital and tested positive for COVID pneumonia. Mum has recovered now and we've been reunited. This is a massive reconciliation after a lifelong time spent separated from one another. I never felt safe before inside. Since choosing to follow Jesus and knowing that the Holy Spirit dwells inside me and will always be with me, I am learning to conquer fear through prayer. Today, I stand in confidence with faith and hope. I feel protected and surrounded by the love of our Lord and my Saviour, Jesus Christ. With Christ my Saviour, I